Hi, this is Ebonique, the founder of Budget Collector, a company dedicated to developing new art collectors like me and hopefully you. So I am obsessed, so obsessed with this piece by Enrique Gra called Mulata Cartagenera. And it's absolutely stunning. I could stare at this piece for hours and hours and I definitely think that you should do the same. And because I'm so obsessed, I started researching so much about the artist, wanting to know how this piece developed in his other works. And I don't like any of his other works as much as I love this piece. And this piece won him an award, which was one of his first award-winning pieces in Colombia. And so I wanted, as I learned and researched more about this piece, I saw so much about Colombian art that needs to be told. And so I wanted to tell that story to you. Um, and just to have it as an English language, because so much of the content that I found was in Spanish and um, my family is from Costa Rica, so I can read a little bit of Spanish. And if I need help, I can ask my father who is a native Spanish speaker. Um, and it's just incredibly intriguing and I can't wait to tell every last bit of this story um so not only is does it touch on you know this piece itself it has a very sexual connotation and if you know anything about colombia and cartagenera it's uh there's some history there and so we'll delve into that history and then not only that but um the politics of bringing modern art into colombia so we'll we'll discuss a little political intrigue and then not only that but we're going to talk about colonization because you know how I do so we're going to talk about um, calling things uh, pre-Columbian or we're going to just delve into racial topics in a way that I'm uncomfortable but we'll do it and we'll come out better people for doing this so it's going to be incredible and awesome and I am so excited to deliver content once a month on this topic. It's, it's to me, it's just the most fascinating, intriguing thing um, and I hope that you agree. So please, please make sure you like and subscribe and hit that notification bell because this is going to be awesome and life-changing and everything interesting that could ever possibly be this is what this series intends to be and you are going to help me get there so please tell me if you find something incredibly interesting about this piece if you find something that inspires you about this piece or if you like someone an artist from colombia or you liked a special time in colombia this is, series is going deep so help me get there by commenting anything interesting about colombia that you like or um, just hit the notification button so that you can get the latest updates of this once a month series where I'm going to go crazy. <laughs> so thank you for uh, watching my ch uh, channel and don't forget to consider buying the art gallery um, journal uh, book to help you collect art for the first time. So if you're like me and you just want to delve into art collecting, in a, in a serious way where you make money and that your pieces um, are worth infinitely more than what you bought it for, but also that your pieces speak volumes about who you are, then you will love this book and I hope that you um, pick it up. Anyway, thanks guys, bye. Con mucho placer he aceptado la invitación que me ha dirigido el Cine Bolívar para hablar a mis compatriotas desde esta ciudad. ¿Y dirigirlo? Ha sido para mí muy placentero aceptar la invitación que me ha dirigido el Cine Bolívar para hacer llegar a mis compatriotas algunas palabras de saludo.